Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we're going to show you how to set up your ducks after you successfully installed the Arduino IDE and the cluster protocol libraries. We're going to show you how to take your Arduino board into a successfully installed cluster protocol duck. You can follow all the steps in our wiki tutorial, which is linked below. In this video, we will show you how to set up a small network with two ducks, a papa duck and a mama duck. So you would at least need two LoRa development boards. Connect one of your development boards to the computer and make sure you use a USB data cable. I will be using the Haltech V2 LoRa boards. We are now at step two from the installation instructions and we need to open the Arduino IDE. Once the Arduino IDE is open, you can go to Tools, Board, go to ESP32, and look for the correct development board you will be using. If you don't see ESP32, go back to one of the previous videos and see how you need to install the ESP32 core. Now we can go back to Tools, Port, and look for the correct USB port where you connect to your development board. On macOS, it's USB to UART or USB serial. On Windows, it's a COM port. Next up, we can open the Mamadoc example. Go to File, Examples, scroll all the way down to Cluster Duck, go to Ducks, Mamadoc. This is the basic Mamadoc example. This example sends a test message every 60 seconds. The interval over the test message, you can set on line number 26. Now I will be changing my device ID to Mama Duck by changing the four last characters to Duck. If you want to add more ducks to your network, you will need to give every duck a different device ID. You can now press upload and the sketch will compile and be uploaded to your development board. If the sketch successfully uploaded, you can open the serial monitor, which is the magnifier glass in the top right corner. Look for setup OK. This means your mama flashed successfully. To verify this, you can go to your Wi-Fi, connect to the duck emergency portal, and send a test message. Wait for the captive portal to show up and fill in some test data and click on send. After you press send, open back up the serial monitor and look for your test data. It should say TX data done on the last line. You can also wait for the default sensor to run, which is a test message with a counter. And it should say run sensor OK every 60 seconds. You have now successfully set up a mama duck. Now we need to set up the papa duck. The Papa Duck is your gateway to the World Wide Web. So we will need to set up a Wi-Fi network and an MQTT server that handles all the incoming messages. You can set up your own MQTT server, which is linked below, or you can use your data management system. Reach out to us on Slack or on our website, and we can provide your credentials to set up your own DMS system. We're back in the Arduino IDE, we can close the Mama example and go back to File, Examples, back to Cluster Duck, Ducks, and open the Papa Duck example. We will need to provide a couple credentials here to get the Papa Duck running. First is your SSID and password for your local Wi Fi network at your house. The SSID is the Wi Fi name and the password is your Wi Fi's password. Please make sure your Wi Fi is a 2.4 GHz Wi Fi. If you don't know what that is, we have detailed instructions as, as well in the link below. Next up, we will need to provide some MQTT credentials. 
reach out to us for DMS credentials, or set up your own MQT broker on, for example, IBM Cloud. Instructions for DMS and IBM Cloud are also linked in the wiki page down below. Provide your credentials and make sure they're all correct. Then click on upload as well and wait for your development board to be flashed. Wait for your PapaDoc to compile and upload. After you're done uploading, you can open up the serial monitor again and look for two important things. Make sure your Wi-Fi is connected and your MQTT is connected. If both of them are successful, you're now ready to use your cluster network. Now we can test the network with a simple message. Make sure both ducts are connected to the power and the LoRa antennas are connected. Make sure your pop duct is connected to your computer and your serial monitor is open. Go to your mama duct and open the Wi-Fi portal. Fill in some test data and click on submit. Watch your pop duct serial monitor for any incoming messages. If it says publish OK, you know your, your network is set up correctly. And now you can start using the cluster duct protocol network. If you have any questions or not the same outcome, please connect to us on Slack or go to our website or wiki page for further FAQs.